When choosing a type of window assembly, there's a variety of factors to consider. What aesthetic do you want? What's the function of the glass? Is cost a factor? If the glass assembly is in a two-hour rated wall, then fire protection for your window or glass partition is required, and achieving protection with a window sprinkler is an option to consider. Let's review a few frequently asked questions about Tyco window sprinklers. Why should a window sprinkler be used instead of a standard sprinkler to protect a window? Window sprinklers are designed to provide full protection for the entire window. The spray pattern wets the full pane of glass from corner to corner, leaving nothing dry. The sprinkler is designed for flat surfaces and typically is not used on sloped, curved, or operable glass. Standard sprinklers, on the other hand, are designed to protect floors and wall areas. While they may wet windows, they are not designed to spray an even coat of water. This means they cannot provide protection equivalent to that of a two-hour fire-rated wall assembly, whereas a window sprinkler is designed to do just that. What are the installation differences between a window sprinkler and a concealed window sprinkler? Exposed window sprinklers are designed to be installed directly in front of the glass, up to four inches away. This sprinkler sits one to four inches below the top of the glass. Concealed window sprinklers are designed to be installed as hidden within the ceiling and therefore are more aesthetically pleasing. They can be placed anywhere from flush to four inches above the top of the glass and six to 12 inches away from the glass. Should a window sprinkler be used on every pane of glass? A window sprinkler is intended to be installed on each pane of glass if the pane is separated by a vertical mullion. The sprinkler's water distribution will stay within the vertical barriers and provide protection to that window only. If the panes of glass are separated or framed using butt joints, then a window sprinkler is not required for every pane. In installation, each sprinkler should be placed a minimum of six feet apart and a maximum of eight feet apart. Why is a pony wall necessary? A pony wall is designed to protect the window or glass from any potential fire hazards or combustible materials that might be stored against the glass itself. Per manufacturer's recommendation, all combustible materials must be kept a minimum of two inches from the face of the glass. You can construct a pony wall using methods and materials based on the type of construction required for the building, as long as it meets the minimum fire resistance rating required by local and state building codes. When can a pony wall be eliminated? A pony wall can be eliminated when the building owner determines other methods to keep combustible materials two or more inches away from the window, and their methods are found acceptable by the local authority having jurisdiction. For example, when a window sprinkler is used with specific glass products that are alternatives to fire-rated assembly, a pony wall might not be necessary. A pony wall can also be removed if a window sprinkler is used with Firelight Plus WS glass, a specific type of fire-rated glass. Other than the use of Firelight Plus WS glass, some method for physically separating fire hazards from the protected glass must be undertaken. What's the cost-benefit of using a window sprinkler? Let's take an example of a glass window assembly that's 8 feet wide by 13 feet tall, or 104 square feet. Assuming the approximate cost of two-hour rated glass uninstalled is $90 per square foot, the total cost would come out to $9,360. As an alternative, if you use tempered glass, the average cost per square foot is $25 uninstalled. In addition, a window sprinkler is required on both sides of the glass and costs around $1,000 uninstalled. Therefore, the final price of a tempered glass window with two window sprinklers is $3,600. Going with this option saves you more than 62%, and when the building has multiple windows, it creates even greater cost savings for the entire project. So, when thinking about designing your next window assembly, we hope these FAQs will help in your decision-making process. Visit us at www.tyco-fire.com to learn more or contact your local Johnson Controls fire suppression representative to discuss your specific application. Thanks for watching.